Hello everybody, it's me again, Francisco Tupi from Brazil. Do you remember me? I remember you. Now, this clip, this class, is about a popular board game from Brazil, an analog game played by the Brazilian Indians, the traditional population from Brazil. So, in this video, I will teach you how we can create and play this game. This game is called Ounce Game. Do you know what is an ounce? Ounce is a kind of feline. Here we have the ounce. You know, could be called the Jaguar, Pantera. This is a feline and uh, this animal inspired a game played by the Brazilian Indians. In Brazil, before the Europeans and Africans, Africans arrived, the Indians was the nation which lived here before. So, that's the game. That's what we will create. The ounce game. The game is so simple. We have 14 pieces. We need to create 14 pieces to represent the dogs. Just one piece to represent the ounce. And this is the shape, the form of the board game. How uh, we will create the game? So, uh, the creativity is yours. Don't you worry with the materials, the forms, what you will uh, use to build up the game. You will do what we want to do. So, it's not a fixed rule. The most important is create the game. So, if you can create, okay, perfect. So, you can create the game in a small size, even in a big size. You can do on the floor or tracing on the ground or using anything else to, to use as a platform. So, for we construct the board, we have a sequences of steps to trace the draw. If you have any doubt after my explanation, don't you worry. See the video, see the slides with the board and try to reproduce the draw. So, the first part is this part here. We need to trace a kind of square, okay? Here I am doing this just for you understand how we can do this square. After we do the square, we do a cross in the middle of the parts of the square. After this, we will have four squares. So, we will split again all parts are the same in the same measure, okay? After that, what we will do? In the diagonal, we will trace a line, another line, and a square inside the square with diagonals. As I am doing here. After that, we will see this measure and this measure, here this measure, and we will trace this line. After this, we will see this measure and we will transport, transfer this measure to this part in the middle of this line. In the end of this line, 
we will use the measure of the square side after that we'll join this part to this and this part to this and make this the final result is this if you have have some difficult or something else just sort this image this part and try to reply inside the game we have the board game and the pieces so we need to do the pieces the pieces the only rule we need to differentiate the dogs and the ounce and you can use all material as you can could be recycled uh, materials paint materials sculpted carpet stone so that is the final game that is the setup game after we constructed the board game and after we create the pieces this is the setup okay when you when we we restart the game we will set the pieces as this way here we have uh, some examples to expire for we see and use to inspire to construct to build your game so stones here we can see pieces of stone and the the board game traced in the floor sculpted pieces here we have the ounces and here the dogs any piece you can use as buttons wood stone we can carve it in the wood so feel free to use the the best way you can to construct the game so here we have the rules i i made first part the rules in direct test text and after that the rules with examples so the first rule two people uh, this game is designed for two players one player will control the ounce and other player will count control the 14 dogs always 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 the ounce will start the game so if i am playing with my friend if my friend is controlling the ounce he will start but if in another time i start play with the ounce i will start the movement is we can move one piece for each time so after that the other player will move we just follow the trace on the floor to the adjacent to the next knot after this is the time of the other player so other player will make a movement i will do a movement another player will do a movement the ounce can capture the dog jumping over it towards an empty house each time the ounce jumping over toward the dog we will we will took off the, this piece from the board ounce can do a lot of uh, if has condition the ounce can do a lot of jumps as much they can 
the winning stage of the game, the winning conditions. For the player one, the player who is control, the dog is immobilize the ons. Make uh, when ons uh, can't make any movement, the ons lost. For the ons, need capture five dogs after jumping over over the dog. The if the ounce do this five times, the ounce will win the, the match. So, the, the rules with a graphical representation. So, this is the board game, the pieces of board game. So, this side of with the triangle will stay the player two, the ounce player. And uh, the trace, the side with the square side, will stay player one. So, <coughs> this is an example of the, the square. So, here is the ounce. In this condition, ounce can walk can move for any knot okay so the ounce can here can here 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 as same the dog the dog can walk for all these directions because this is a empty houses empty spaces empty knots okay clear it here we have uh, a game example let's suppose in the match we have this condition so the dog the sorry the house have four possibilities here or here or here or here let's suppose I will come to here so I drag and drop my piece I trace my piece to this direction okay now is the dog time dog can walk to here can walk to here and i will choose walk here or walk here let's pause here so i will come here with this piece so after I move my piece, the ounce can move considering my first move with the ounce, I can go here or here. This is how we initiate our match. So ounce can go here. After ounce moved to here. I can move this piece for here. After I move this piece for here, I can go here. And move my piece. So I will play with the next rules we will see. The the rule of capture the piece. So for the ounce, ounce is allowed to jump over the dog and capture the dog so here is the house house will jumping over the dog when when the house jumping over the dog the piece will stay here okay and this dog jumped over 
will be drag drop it or over the board. In this other condition, this house is full. It is not empty house, so the house can't jump because the all the movements, all the destinations need to be empty for the piece occupy this knot. So in this case. I am playing with the house, I can't jump in over, I can't capture. I can go here, I can go here, go here, go here. But in this case, I can't capture this dog. For the house is allowed to jump in many times as it can jump. So here jump once but here we have a empty space too so i can jump over again and after that i will drag drop these two pieces here we have another condition the I can, with the ounce, jumping over the dog here. After this, this piece is dragged and dropped out the board game. After here, I can repeat my movement in my same time of uh, play, in my turn. I can jump here and I jump here. Let's suppose if the the dog we have once more dog here in this part. Okay, we will jump again and drag and drop this piece again. And if you have here, jump again. So when the house attacks, it can repeat the movement. S can do the movement. So here the finishing the game condition we have the two possibilities. Let's split here. Here is the dog go. How the dog can win the game. So let's suppose I am playing with the ounce. I can go to here. No, because here is not a house. I can go here. No. I can jump over and capture. No, because it's filled this house. Even the same. So when the house can't move, she's captured by the dog and the dog won the game. So I repeat the conditions in four examples but when you play with your friend you can find another way to to close the house here is the same and here is the same you lock the house on the board game and the house goal we will see now just the house each Five dogs capture, five dogs jumping over, five dogs here, and when this dog is drag drop it out of the board game, the ounce won the game. Okay, pessoal, there is the the class, the video class about uh, how we can create and how we can play the arms game kakuma i hope you like it the the board game please uh do you have my contact if you want to learn more thing related with games or other things please keep in touch okay enjoy the game and please 
send the pictures, the draws. Let's play together one day. Okay, okay. Bye bye, Kakuma. Thank you so much.